very exciting day. It's our all church pageant. So whether you know it or not, you are in the pageant. You will be uh, have the ability to stay in your seat though. So that might make you feel more uh, at ease. Uh, a couple announcements. One, um, it's it's in the bulletin, but if you didn't notice, uh, giving statements are available for you in the narthex. There's a box with your giving statements. Please try to make sure you pick yours up and save us some money on postage. Uh, and I know, oh, here it has my Oh, it's in Hopefully you, you are aware that we are caroling this afternoon from <coughs> 4 to 6. We'll meet at the church at 4 o'clock and we'll try to get, uh, we've we got about six places to go. Uh, hopefully we'll finish by 6, return to the church uh, around that time to have uh, chili and uh, some, some goodies and some cookies and such. Um, we're kind of short on people. Uh, guys, uh, you don't have to be in this thing to do this. Believe me, I've been doing this for several years and it's uh, a lot of fun. The people really appreciate it. Uh, and I'm not saying I'll do it, but uh, anyway, uh, please consider uh, coming. Weather, uh, <clears throat> well, you want to dress warmly. Uh, we are getting a little bit of a break. Uh, according to the ground, it's supposed to be about 20 in the time period that we will be out there. The wind is going to be 3 to 5 miles an hour. That's a kind of move. So uh, we will be inside in two places. Uh, several places will be wind sheltered to a certain degree. So anyway, I'm going to be good today. So please uh, come at 4 o'clock. We're going to be in the park center. 410, we hope, so please be on time. Thank you. Thanks, Terry. Uh, just a reminder that this uh, Thursday is our Blue Christmas worship service. Uh, this is a, a service that's targeted towards people who um, have uh, are having difficulty in, during this Christmas season, whether it's because of illness or uh, recent loss or uh, loss of this, maybe not so recent, but you're still grieving. Or if um, I think it's a beautiful service, whether you're grieving or not, so I invite you, as well as anyone you know who um, might uh, that might be an appropriate service for, please do invite them. Um, additionally, I just remember, on behalf of uh, Worship and Music uh, Committee, I would like to invite you after worship to help pack up the pageant stuff and help bring down the. Uh, few candles for Christmas Eve. So um, so those who are uh, willing and able will uh, receive uh, stars in your crown and have it for all. <laughs> Guarantee it. <laughs> Friends, let us prepare our hearts for this.
confessing our sins to God and one another. Please join in the prayer of confession. Shepherd of Israel, God of hosts,
Sorry, Megan. Yeah. Well, I don't know. I was, wasn't there wise men? I thought there was wise men in this part. Oh, right. So we were doing the story from Luke, and the wise men come from Matthew's story. So we're not going to be doing that. I, I always wanted to be a wise man. <laughs>
star that they had seen at its rising until it stopped over the place where the child what child is this? was. <laughs> and then they saw that the star had stopped and they were overwhelmed with joy. On entering the house, they saw the child what child
Holy One who astonishes us with surprising gifts, we pray for your church and for people of faith in every language and belief, that your wisdom will show us our common life, and that all people may rejoice in what you create. Giver of the stars and plants, creator of rivers and oceans and creatures large and small, we pray for wisdom as we live on with your earth. Revoke in us awe for your goodness in these familiar surroundings, our hills and valleys, forests and deserts, that the powers you have placed here to move through soil and air will remind us always of your bounty and your love. Power above all powers, we pray for the leaders of governments in every nation, that they may have wisdom to choose what serves the common good. Lover of all creation, we pray for those who we too easily forget, those of your children who are poor or homeless or in prison, those who are sick or lonely or frightened, all who hunger for faith and hope. Care for them that they may be strengthened by joy in your healing. Holy One in whose community we thrive, we pray for those with whom we share our daily lives our families, friends, and neighbors, those with whom we work and play, those whose names we do not know who provide for us, that we may all be renewed in courage and nurtured in hope. Sustainer of your people, we give you thanks for members of the body of Christ in every age and every place who by their witness bring us here today. Come to us in Christ, O God, that we may live in this world by faith, may see that faith confirmed in the world to come. Through the risen one who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. We pray in the name of the one who taught us to pray, saying, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debts. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. You'll note that I have it listed in the bulletin that we are singing the, the closing hymn uh, responsibly. So that means responsibly and responsibly. Uh, so if you are on this side of the chair, or a little heavy on this side, but we have lots of choir members on this side, so I think we'll be okay. If you're on this side, you're going to sing the parts that start saying Watchmen, and if you're on this side, you're going to start with the parts that say Traveler. And if you sing the wrong part, it's okay. And if you just love it so much and want to sing it all, that's okay too. Let us sing our closing time.
7 p.m., so please be here for that. And this year, Christmas Day falls on a Sunday, so we do have worship on Christmas Day, and it will be a carol sing, so if you're like, I hate that Megan never sings Christmas songs during Advent, this is your time. Be here. And also for Carol, and that's also your time. Be there for that as well. Friends, go out in the world in peace. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the power of the Holy Spirit be with you now and always.